Good morning. I'm out at Recapture Reservoir. It's early in the morning on my paddleboard. I'm excited to be down here again. I've done a few trips out here in the past and they've been awesome. Hopefully I learn a few things today. Don't know what they're going to bite or what they're going to do. Hopefully I catch them and I'm going to show you how to catch them. And make sure to check out the blog post below in the description so you can get even more details of what transpires today and I'm gonna go crack some bass for you. Here we go. Let's get stoked. Blah! All right, ready to launch. Looks good, flood brush, rock piles, let's go. Ooh, let's check the temp. Sixty degrees. Sixty one. Freaking spawning right now. It's pretty clear. I might see some beds today. Fish. Right there. Oh, God. First cast. That's a good sign. Even though I had a bite on the jig, I switched to the Kitek stick bait because there was just so much gunk I was picking up on my jig. And so I switched to a weightless bait. And it seemed to make a really big difference. First cast. Nice little bass. Back side of that rock. Nice. Wow, fat little healthy sucker. First cast on that little stick bait. Kitek Sexy Impact. You know, get out here, there's just so much flooded brush the jig is getting all nasty so I'm just gonna stick to this stick bait because it just goes through brush so much better and stays so clean I make a spaz cast up into this bush but cruising up into the bush oh, and see some stuff bass, dude. There's his nest. Oh my gosh, that's a... That's a four and a half pounder. I'll come back and get him. Nice big large mouth. Oh my gosh. Look at this guy. This guy's three and a half pounds. Oh my gosh. Right where I saw him earlier. Get up here, bro. Oh my gosh, there's big bass in here. Oh my gosh, that's a big bass. Wow. Holy crap. That is a tank! Oh my gosh! Whoa! I gotta get a picture with that guy. 
a little sexy impact. He sucked it down. Saw him cruising around in here. Saw a bed and bam. Wind starts picking up. Time to throw the jerk bait. Oh god! Jerk bait bass. Nice one. There's another one. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Trick bait. Another solid bait was the Nico Fat Worm. I caught several fish on it. Check it out in action on a Nico rig. Cast it out and just shake it along the bottom. There's one. Oh, there's a big one. He's in the brush, too. I'm gonna get him. The key to getting fish out of brush is don't pull too hard. Just kind of let them sit in the bush until you drift over them, and then hopefully you can work them out. There he is. Pike. One bass, one pike. Oh, how to recapture. Throwing the Nico rig. They seem to like it. A lot. Put a little nail weight in the head of the bait 
and then that little wacky ring in the center of it and a one aught drop shot hook and you're good to go. And as soon as it calmed off, I really started whacking them. Nice. There he is, Nico Worm. Another largey. <laughs> Two of them on that point. <laughs> That's awesome. Saw a bed here earlier on the back side of that rock. Set my anchor. When bed fishing for largemouth, I go to a drop shot rig. This is a little Ned worm on a 1 8 ounce drop shot weight with a 1 aught hook. It sits right in the bed and the bass eats. Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah. Big one. Off the face of that rock. I saw him earlier. Where is he? Oh, nice bass. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh. He's not a giant, but he is pretty. Oh, pretty fish. I'm just working this little robo Ned worm, green pumpkin, Aaron's magic. This thing is catching them on the drop shot. It's interesting, I wasn't catching them earlier. And then I, the wind started blowing. And now, if I get it in front of one, they'll eat it. But when it was flat calm, I couldn't get a bite. I caught a couple bites, caught a couple, but it's not as good as it is now. I see another bed. I get so excited I almost fall in the lake. Got it. Oh my gosh, this is a big Absolutely one of the grossest feelings in the world. I shake myself off, retie, reposition myself, and I go back after that sucker. Little bed fishing tip. Notice I cast way past the bed and then I reel my bait over the top of it and drop it down instead of casting right on the bed because a lot of times they'll spook off if you drop the bait right on their heads. Reel it over the top of them and then lay it in subtly. He 
with the drop shot is to shake the bait and not the weight. That way it stays in the bed. Got him. Yes, got him that time. Always oh, big. Always oh, big. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is a five pounder. The one that broke me off. Oh no, he's under the board. Oh my gosh. Look at this pig. Oh, they're up there spawning. Oh, come here. Come here. Yes. Yes. This is the one that had my bait in his mouth. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Two drop shot hooks. He broke me off earlier. Oh man. What a pig. Oh, I got you, bro. I got you. Yes! Yes! Ah, just cut this line. Jeez. <laughs> Hooked him once, missed him, threw in. I'm gonna get all my stuff back. All my stuff back. Pull that old hook out. Oh my gosh, what a beast. Look at that. <laughs> oh man, what a sweet fish. That was cool. Here's another bed fish. See how I cast past and then reel the bait over to where he is and leave it in front of him. Yes! Ah, I saw him on the bed. Come back and got him. Oh my gosh, this is a toad. Oh, this is a toad. Oh my gosh, this is a big old bass, dude. Oh my gosh, this is a four pounder. <laughs> oh, this little rope. Oh, get out of there. God. Oh my gosh, I saw that bed and couldn't get him to bite earlier. Come back through this little robo nedworm on a drop shot in there and this beast just crushed it. Oh my, holy cow, that is a Oh, jeez! There you have it. Oh my gosh. Bed fishing, stick bait, jerk bait, recapture reservoir. Awesomeness. Well, there's the one. I'm gonna finish the video off with this bad boy. Four and a quarter pounds, big old bass on a bed out here at Recapture Reservoir. Go to the blog post, learn how to catch bass like this. I'm gonna tell you all the spots, all the baits, and we're gonna let this bad boy go and spawn so that this place can say, stay awesome. Here we go, later baby. <laughs>